Hello everybody, I'm about to um, do some makeup, um, full face makeup, and I wanted to show it to you. I was going to go live on Facebook, but instead I did a, uh, a review for my stuff that I've been using, and um, I wanted to get YouTube a try for uh, pharmacy stuff, so I'm going to go ahead and do my full face makeup and post it on here, and if you can give me comments and stuff about what you like and what you don't like, and just you know comment in the um, things below, and then also hit the subscription and stuff so you can follow me, and I'm going to do some more uh, videos about stuff. Alright, here we go. Um, First of all, I've already done my prepping for my moisturizers, my face creams, and my um, serum moisturizer, and stuff like that. If you want to hear the things I just did, go to my Facebook, and it will um, be all the samples and stuff I just used. So I'm not going to go over that again, um, but I'm going to go ahead and get right into the makeup. Okay, so I've got these liquid full coverage concealers. I'm going to use a lot of ivory to see what I like about it. I need my primer first. I forgot about that. I'm also going to use this and see what I like about it too. This is my primer. It's going to make everything stay on very well. I use the the FX Camera Strobe Primer. I think this is strobe. No, it's not strobe primer. It's photo filter technology. After a moisturizer on your um, book that I use and stuff um, and serum, um, if whenever I do the primer and stuff, it feels so good on your face. So I got my primer and I'm gonna go ahead and I'm just prepping my skin. It's a big thing to prep your skin. If you don't prep your skin, then it's just makeup on there. So I'm putting it all over the eyeshadow, uh, the eye lids. Okay, so I have all my primers ready. I'm gonna put in some, um, now I'll put my lip conditioner. It's all about moisturizing everything you have. Moisturize. Okay, so I put all my, all my primers, have all my moisturizing, everything like that on. So now I'm going to go in with um, a concealer. Okay. I think I'm going to take this right here and dab it. Ooh. A little goes a long ways. I can definitely see. So... I may not be great at playing concealer or great at playing makeup, but I just want to give y'all and let y'all know what it does, the results of it. I really like this. This is the first time I'm using it, and I really like it. I think I put a little bit too much on there, but I really like it. It really brightens up the skin. Oh wow, I really like that. Okay. I went ahead and did my concealer. And then I'm going to, since I really like it, I'm actually going to like conceal some of my spots. I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> okay, now I'm going to go in with my, um, 
I don't know if I want to do tint moisturizer. I'm going to go on the CC, CC cream, I think. Yeah, so I did my stain mat, and that's for Oli's face. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and go with my CC cream for this time and not put anything else on. Just because my face needs to be so much moisturized. And I just want to put a little bit. Does that have to go a long way? And then I'm going to bounce it in. I know that seems not a lot. And I'm going to bounce it in. May go over it one more time. Okay. I'm gonna go ahead and do it one more time. Just because I can get that full coverage look. Cause CC cream is full coverage, but it's not. I like really full of coverage. So I'm going to go one more time. Now we're just going to blend. that I don't want it to my skin. Okay. So that really color pricks it a whole lot. I think I'm going to use, instead of just doing CC cream, I think I'm going to use, um, I may use a serum. I don't know. We'll see. Let's see what I have of samples. I just do that instead. Okay, that's okay. I gotta get more samples. Okay, so that's my CC cream. And then I'm gonna go in with um, my palette. Now I'm going to go in, and this is like a foundation brush and stuff, but I'm going to go ahead and like outline and stuff because I like to use things for different purposes. So, there's a difference between bronzing and a difference between um, contouring. And if you go on my Facebook page, you will see what the difference is. Um, I'm going to go ahead and just do my regular one. It's like a bronzing and contouring at the same time in between. So, here we go. Okay, so what you're gonna do is, here, let me put my hair back. You're gonna go from here, right here, and you're gonna take it, suck in your cheeks, so I'd suck in my cheeks all the time. A straight line. And then, Okay, then and then Okay, 
Now, wipe the excess makeup off. And then I'm gonna go in and highlight. Okay, then I'm gonna go in and do my blush. You're thinking, what is she doing? I'll show you. Now, I'm gonna go in and blend. Now I'm gonna use my other blush. See, he really contoured my face. And then, I'm gonna go in with a blush. Behind the blush. No. Pharmacy blush. Love. make that cheek shine. Okay. Then I'm going to go set everything. My transparent powder brush. Transparent powder brush, I set everything, 
and then I'm going to go my palette sorry I'm trying to find it all oh and why I am looking at this tea tree and stuff your bumps are awesome I love my cream eyeshadows. And then I put some pharmacy white highlight this. Then I think that's for my eyebrows, uh, my eyebrows, but, okay, let me get out my other one, okay, Yeah, my eyeliner. It's not perfect, but it's just how good it goes on. And then
concealer. Let me see if I can find my eyebrows. And then my eyebrows. I have Elf one in front now, and then I'll get this, get the pharmacy in a little bit. Okay. I'm not very good at eyebrows, but there you go. There's my look.